And speaking of folks coming to town, Nightly News is in town right here behind us uh, oh. on East 4th Street. Russ Mitchell has even stepped out of the studio to join us here on East 4th. You got to talk to Lester a little bit ago. What, what did. did you guys talk about? It was a lot of fun. We talked about the series, of course, across America. Last night they were in Louisville. The night before that they were in Orlando. So, yes, we talked about the series, and I got his thoughts about Cleveland as well. Across America, tell me about the series. The, the whole idea, well, we've done uh, several of these, and generally during election years, you know, getting the pulse of the nation, that sort of thing. But this year, we wanted to come out and hit five cities and look through their eyes, the coming out, the, the country trying to get back on its feet. And, you know, Cleveland has been on our list for a number of reasons, uh, but this time it really worked in that theme. I know you talked to the school board president, school board superintendent, I should say, and I know today you were out with Stammy Paul, one of our local graffiti artists. Yeah, we, I love what's happening in Cleveland with the, the art scene, the murals, and the whole story behind graffiti artists. You know, it's kind of in the shadows. A lot of times it's illegal, but they've embraced it in a big way, uh, coming to the spotlight. I think it's a really cool story. Uh, the school story really fits in this theme we're talking about, how different communities are, are coming back. You know, a lot of kids got left behind, no fault of their own, of course, uh, but what they're doing here with the uh, Cleveland schools and trying to reimagine what summer classes look like to bring kids back is really pretty neat, and we wanted to share it with the rest of the country. And as Betsy said, behind us, the nightly news crew is uh, getting everything set. Betsy, it's quite a beehive of activity. They've it's been here for about, uh, well, since this morning, really getting this together. Right, it's very fancy. You know, we, we've been talking a lot about our work from home situations and right. how you kind of hodgepodge things together. This is a whole nother level of television, so it's kind of oh, fun yeah. to see it all in action. Thank you so much. I'm looking forward to hearing your Gojo story, too. It's going to be fun. Up. Went to Gojo, the manufacturer of Purell, yeah. for an exclusive look. That's coming up tonight on Nightly News at 6.30 for preview for at 6 o'clock. Russ gets on the Nightly News. Nah. Can't wait to watch that. Sure. <laughs> Jay, back to you.